everyone and welcome back to All You Knit Is Love. Um, just an update really on um, <coughs> on the cardigan. Um, I've done both the fronts. I've completed the back. So that's the back. Um, there. Yeah. Is it that way? Yeah, that way. That's the pattern, double moss stitch. So that's the back and then the that way. <laughs> so that made me think the two fronts as well. Um and I've started the sleeve and I just I just thought um to come back and work on Monday. I couldn't go back because you know when I it's now five days you can come out after five days as long as you get two lateral negative flows. But I was in for seven days, but I did, couldn't get two natural, uh, two negative lateral flows on the trap within the ten days to get out before the tenth day isolation. I just couldn't do it. My body just wasn't registering a negative, so I had to stay in the full ten days. So in the ten days, I've done the back and two fronts, and I could have got more done, but I've been found reading again and do you know what I mean and then just catching up on television programs I've not watched and things like that anyway I've started the sleeves I'm on the second sleeve I've nearly finished nearly completed the shaping the increasing on the sleeve I've nearly finished that um but I decided did I want an all over pattern like that or did I want something a bit different so I've done something a dip, dip, bit different I've done so normal stocking stitch niche pearl knit knit pearl either side um, and then i've done a panel of double moss stitch in the middle um so it's just there it's just a panel in the middle so that's what i've done um and i just thought you know just something different so that will run central like i've done it as central as i can um that will run down the down the arm same pattern as that as the back and fronts but just in the middle just to take it off a bit so yeah that's what I've decided to do if you can hear snoring again it's my little dog she's been to the groomers this morning it's like my son messaged me last night Ryan because it's as I've said before she's Ryan's dog but when he moved out with and brought <coughs> got his own place with his girlfriend Molly and um, it was the coach house that he got no garden or anything um, so I just he just said to me if you don't mind, you, you can have her. And I said, well, yeah, because I'm with her all the time anyway. So she was stayed here, but obviously, right, she's still Ryan's dog. Um, and he messaged me last night, and he says, groomers have messaged me this morning. I forgot to tell you. Um, she's at groomers, did you know, at quarter to ten. So I said, no, no, I didn't, but I do now. Um, so she's had to go to the groomers this morning, but she's flat out. When she comes back from the groomers, she's absolutely shattered. Um, she's, as you can hear I mean she, she sleeps a lot anyway but she's exhausted she's not I've got up and gone into the kitchen to make coffee and she's not even followed so um mind you I better forgot something to eat her ears would perk up um but yeah so and then while she was at the groomers they said I picked her up and she said has she been all right so I said well yeah why so she's when we're uh, um washing her and we well, like lifted her a back end up under her tummy she yelped and she screamed like cried out so I said she does do it sometimes she has been to the vets and um, it's something to do with um their hips and the the it's just the breed the breed's got that many things wrong with them to be honest with you um so it's I said she's been multiple times for that and there's nothing really they can can do they just give her a bit of pain relief or something like that I said when well, she has she has flare-ups of it um but she's okay, she's not yelled. I picked her up to put her in the car to put her seatbelt on and she was perfectly fine and then I took her seatbelt off and lifted her out of the car when we got back and she walked down the driveway and in into the house so she's perfectly fine. I don't know, sometimes it's just, Jack came in from work before I had Covid because he's not seen her while I've had Covid but before I had Covid he came in from work one night and he went to give her a cuddle and she screamed out. Um, she just does, I don't know. It's just one of them things. Anyway, don't forget to like and subscribe. It's been a beautiful day here today. 
really beautiful, really cold, but now it's just, I'm looking at it, it's just gone all grey. Um, but yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe, speak to you all soon, bye.